Hey everyone, welcome to a new video. Finally, V0 has published their own AI model. This is the official post that we are releasing V0's AI model. And this model is specialized for the web development. And we know that some days ago, Cloud4 got published and they claimed in their post that this Cloud Opus 4 is the world based coding model. And also we know that Cloud Sonnet 3.7 was based and after that the upgradation to Cloud Sonnet 4 is also based in coding right and also there is another model which is this Gemini 2.5 Pro and this is also based and that is a Gemini 2.5 Flash so whether we should go for this V0's AI model or not in this video we will discuss in detail and also I will show you that how you can use this V0's new AI model right and uh, the interesting thing is that they have published two new model one model is this v0 1.0 md and another model is this v0 1.5 md now to use this v0 1.5 md or this v0 1.5 lg you have to go to their v0 dot official url where we generally generate the website uh, the full stack website right and here under this drop down here you see there are two model one is this v0 medium another one is this v0 large so currently this medium you will get access as a free user so if i show you the pricing page then here you will see for the free user you will get this five dollar of included monthly credit and also this access to v0 1.5 md now the question is that why they have made another model which is v0 1.0 md which is designed for the building modern web application because the main reason is there are many models in the market like cloud 4 and this gemini 2.5 pro but that model are not specifically for the web development so they, that models uh, can be used for the general chat purpose or can be used for the web development or can be used for any other purpose. But these V0 models are specifically designed for the web development purpose. And if you go to their official post, here you see web development knowledge. That means during making this model, they have provided this web development knowledge to this model. and. Uh, that's why we will get the best output and i hope you know that when we use any model then we use the system prompt what is system prompt suppose you are using the cloud 4 or gemini 2.5 pro then before using that model we specify that you are a specific uh, specialized web developer you have knowledge in react JS or next JS and you have the capability to solve the complex problem in backend using spring boot or something else technology please do these things for me right this is a system prompt that we provide but this v0 model is actually have that system prompt previously built in so you don't have to mention anything uh, when using this v0 model and also it is open ai compatible api and you can use this model in cursor codex or your own app okay so by providing this capability to use in cursor there's a huge chance that this cursor will make a huge competition with the other ai code editor like vs code or that one serve it has many features like it supports text and image inputs and it provides fast streaming responses and uh, in case of plot 4 there was a issue that it uh, it is a little bit, bit slow but here you see it provides the fast streaming responses this model has some extra features that will make this model more powerful so the first feature is this framework award completion it is a more powerful feature and uh, here you see evaluated on modern stacks like nextjs and Vorstel. and when you are building any project using any technology or any stack then it is necessary that that model should have the idea that what actually happens in that technology right but this cloud 4 and this gemini 2.5 pro they were trained on some specific models and some specific prompts or some specific technologies okay they were not 
specialized for the web development so in that case it will be some kind of little bit difficult for that models to understand the exact uh, problems so there this model this v0 model can be a uh, game changing technology okay and also here you see autofix identifies and corrects common coding issues during generation again i am mentioning that they have trained this v0 model this v0 uh, 1.0 md model for the web development knowledge uh, some common coding errors some common coding problems okay and that's why if you give any issues to this model that i am facing this issue in my code in that case this model have the better capability to solve or better capability to give the correct answer than the other models right and also this quick edit streams inline edits as they are available next one is this open ai compatible can be used with any tool or sdk that supports open ai format and that is actually helpful if you want to use this v0 1.0 md model with client or ru code in that case there is an option to choose the open ai compatible if i show you go to this vs code and go to this client setting and there you will find this open ai compatible so select it and there you have to provide this base url now how to find this base url i have this uh, post and here you see if i scroll down below this is the endpoint here you see this is the endpoint you have to provide and after that you have to provide your api key here and here provide the model id what is the model id let me show you and the model id is this v0 1.0 md and you are good to go you will get the actual output from this model it supports the multimodal means both text and image out inputs so it will be helpful if you combine it with this stitch so some days ago i made a video on this google stitch so it was a ui ux designer where you can generate the design for your website or for your mobile app or it can be website so generate the design with this google stitch and provide the design to this uh, v0 model and it will generate the entire website for you you will, you will get the best output and uh, if i talk about the pricing and the other features here you see that uh, it has 128k total context that is actually similar to the clock and uh, there is a 32k output context and the pricing is actually similar to the cloud 4 so cloud 4 also the pricing was three dollar per one million input token and fifteen dollar per one million output token okay the pricing is actually similar to this uh, cloud i don't know why they have kept the uh, same uh, similar uh, pricing gemini 2.5 pro has a different pricing like uh, less than 200k tokens it is 1.25 dollar and greater than 200k token it is 2.5 dollar input price okay but we will not go for the pricing because this model is specifically for the web development as they have mentioned so we have to use this model for our coding purpose it is my recommendation that you should go for this visual model if you are doing something related to web development so two model i will recommend you in this video one is cloud sonnet 4 and another one is this v0's new model yesterday i made a video on this uh, cloud 4 or gemini 2.5 pro so again i am uh, mentioning that if you want to do any task related to this related to this web development then you should definitely go for this v0 new model which is this v0 1.0 md okay and if you want to do any chat completion purpose or any specific another task purpose or any uh, suggestion purpose then in that case you can go for this cloud sonnet 4 because uh, this model this v0 model is specifically for the web development for the free tier version it is available daily i think you will get this three messages per day yes for the free user it is three messages per day so please try it on your own and let me know uh, in the comment section 
your feedback your experience your thought and i hope this video is helpful for you guys you got to know many things from this video if you want to get this type of videos this detailed explanation then don't forget to subscribe this channel and don't forget to like this video see you guys in the next video thanks for watching